What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I am the Bald Ginger. We're jumping back into some road to the show here. We got a four game set against Cincinnati, but we're playing in St. Louis. So this should be a fun one. We are currently leading the division by three games coming into this series. Like to win three of these, but if we end up with a split, I'm okay with that. I'm second in the National League with batting average with a 321 average. Okie dokie, bottom half of the first inning. Chris Paddock on the mound. He's got a 97 mile an hour four seamer. 96 on the two seamer. Nothing else fast. I got a runner on first and only one out here. First pitch, and that's inside for a ball. Four seamer just missed the inside corner. All right. Second pitch of the at bat. We're going to see what we can do with this one if it's anything good. Nope, also inside, just off the plate. It's now a 2-0 count. I know he's trying to get me to swing at one of these, but uh, inside pitches usually don't get me to do that unless they're up and in. And I'll take that circle change over the outside corner. That's fine and dandy. It's now a 2-1 count. Trying not to hit that double play. There's a four-seamer at 96, way late on the swing, fouling it off down the right field line. It's now even at two and two. Pitch number five in the at-bat here, and that's an easy take with a 12-6 curve way outside. It's a full count with only one out. Let's go, boys. See if we can get this ball rolling here in the first. And there's one down the right field line. I don't know, should I go for two? Oh, I'm going two, most definitely. Totally missed that one. He's going to run around and score from first on the double. Piece of cake, RBI action here in the first. Thing of beauty, thing of beauty. Nothing else happened there because top of the second, we got Brendan Rodgers at the plate for Cincinnati. Scores one to nothing, St. Louis on top. There's nobody on, one away. 0-2 pitch for Rodgers. There's one I barely have to move to get to. That's an easy play for two away. <laughs> an absolutely terrible throwback in. What was that? I mean, not like I had control of it or anything, but wow. All right, bottom of the third. We're up to the plate. Two out, nobody on. Hmm. Let's see what we can do this time around. Oh, it gives me a four-seamer center cut. Popped it up to the center fielder. Just short of the warning track out there, right at the top of the arch in the outfield grass. That's going to end the third inning there. First pitch, Hackett. Bottom of the six coming up to the plate again. Cincinnati is up three to one now. There's nobody on and two away. Still got the Cincinnati starter on the mound. He's only thrown 55 pitches to this point in the game. He's really uh, working through it quickly. And there's a chopper foul down the third baseline out in front of that circle change. All right, let's see what we get here on the 0-1 pitch. Nothing worth swinging at. Circle change bounced off the plate. And we're back to even at one and one. He gave me a little floater there, and I took it out to right field. That's going to be a single. So now I've got the easiest part of the cycle done here in the bottom of the six. I got the double. I got the single. Now I just need a triple and a home run. If anybody's been following the channel, I obviously don't hit triples very often. I only have three so far since starting this character, and that has been one in each of my major league seasons. There's a little drive out here to right field at the top of the eighth. That's the easy play for the first out. And Cincinnati's still holding on to a 3-1 lead here. Also top of the eighth, Eugenio Suarez at the plate. He's only hitting 247 on the season, but he's 2-3 for three today. Nobody on, 2 away, and he's got an 0-2 pitch coming to him here. Let's see what happens. Oh, he's taking it deep. Going to be off the bullpen wall here. I think I might be able to run it down, and I do. How about that? I like it. That ends the inning there. Bottom of the eighth coming up to the plate. Runner on first and two away. Okay. Advance the runner in the first three pitches or advance the runner to third base or better. Uh, dang it. Uh, we'll do the uh, third or better. What the heck? All right, reliever on the mound, Paul Perez. He's got a 98-mile-an-hour four-seamer. Nothing else fast. First pitch is low and outside. Change up at 81. That's a 1-0 count now. Attendance 33,344. Interesting number there. I wonder how they come up with those. 
And he puts one in the zone. That's up the middle. That's going to get the runner to third out. No, he holds up at uh, second base. All right. Didn't advance the runner to third or better. So I failed the challenge, but I got on base. So that's a perk. We have tied it up, though. Top of the ninth. Nobody out, nobody on. Brendan Rodgers at the plate. He's over three on the day. And he's got an 0-1 count here. Let's see what happens with this pitch here. A little floater out to right field, not too far away from me. So that's an easy play for the first out. All right, still top of the ninth. Runner on first, two away for Dom T. Williams. It's one for three on the day. He's got a 1-1 count. Let's see if what he does with this pitch here. Puts a good little drive into it. Deep right field. Not going to get there. That's probably going to score the run. Yep, they're sending him from third, and they're not going to get him at the plate. Ball did not get there in time. Now it is a 4-3 lead for Cincinnati. Oof. They win by that score of 4-3. Well, you win some, you lose some. This time we lost. We're going to head on to the next game in the series and see if we can turn this around a little bit. All right, coming up to the plate, bottom of the first, no score, nobody on, two away. We've got an eight-game hitting streak on the line here. That's interesting. Pitcher on the mound's got 101 mile an hour, four-seamer. Nothing else even remotely close to fast there, so that's kind of interesting. Curveball there at 80 miles an hour, way off the plate away. So, yeah, that's uh, peculiar. Could be ripping triple digits with the four-seamer. But nothing else even approaching 90 miles an hour. What is that, 87? No, 88 on the slider. That's the fastest pitch he's got besides that four-seamer. And, man, he knows I can't catch up to it. 101 mile an hour four-seamer up in the zone, late on the swing, and that just basically threw it way up in the air. The right fielder makes the play there for the third out. Bottom of the fourth, nobody out, nobody on here. Still got Hunter Green on the mound. And no score in this one. Ooh, slider on the inside corner. That should have been a strike, I think. But it was called a ball, so it's a 1-0 count. Four-seamer there, off the plate inside as well. And it's now 2-0. Pitcher is definitely falling behind in this at-bat. Swing and a miss. The four-seamer over the inside corner, but high. Way too late of a swing anyway, so now it's a 2-1 count. And four-seamer at 101 mile an hour. Again, late swing, fouling it off. It's 2-2. Two and two. We're back even here. And a changeup low and inside. Almost had the timing right on it. Didn't make the greatest contact, so just fouled that off. We're doing a 2-2 pitch again. That's an easy take. Slider way inside. Makes the count full here. This should be an action pitch here. Let's see what happens. And it's a four-seamer right above the knees. Got it out to right field for a single. The hit streak is now up to nine games. Cody Bellinger up at the plate, though, top of the fifth. Still no score. Runner on first for him and nobody out. 2-1 count against Mason Thompson on the mound for the Cardinals. Let's see what happens here and what he's sending out to right field. Let's go a little groove into this one. Not too deep, though. Able to make the play. And get the ball back in. Prevents the runner from advancing. That's the first out of the top of the fifth. All right. Bottom of the sixth. St. Louis up one to nothing now. There's a runner on first and only one out. Still got Hunter Green on the mound for Cincinnati. He's thrown 63 pitches to this point in the game. And here's the first pitch of this at bat. Easy take on the four-seamer low in the way. And of course, the game has to remind me that I've hit into 12 double plays this season. How lovely. Oh, four-seamer, and I popped it up. First baseman, but first baseman is going to get a glove on that one. Not a hope and a prayer of a base hit there. That 101-mile-an-hour fastball has been my undoing. Uh, bottom of the eighth, since he's come back with a vengeance, they are now up 4-1. to one. There's a runner on first, two out. Jose Ruiz on the mound. He's got a 99-mile-an-hour four-seamer, 90 on the circle change, 93 on the slider. Got a good variety of pitches there, and I'm swinging at a four-seamer off the plate inside for strike one. Super late swing. I don't know what the heck I was thinking swinging at that, but what can you do? You smile and wave, wait for the next pitch, and then I watch a four-seamer over the outer third of the plate, and I'm in a hole 0-2 in a hurry here. 
Wow. And fouling off a four-seamer straight back into the screen. Still an 0-2 count here. He's given me a steady diet of fastballs so far. And there's another fastball off the plate away. So that's finally ball one. And it's now a count of one and two. And another easy take slider way outside. Worked it back to even finally after five pitches. The count is now two and two. We're going to see what we get here. Oh, line drive right to the center fielder. Oh, he drops it. you got to be kidding me. Holy cow. They sent him. Oh, my goodness. Got him at the plate. Man. I got the single, but they got him down at the plate trying to score from first on that little dribbler out to center field. I, I don't get that. Since he ends up taking the win, 4-1 to one is the final score. We're going on to the next game. Hopefully we can turn this around a little bit. This club, ball club this year has been really, really hit and miss. We're either really knocking her around and having a good old time winning a bunch of games, or we're just getting our butts handed to us on a silver platter. Top of the first, Jonathan India leading it off for Cincinnati. Nobody out, nobody on, obviously. And an 0-1 count here, and he's sending something out to right field. Let's see what it is here. Routine fly ball, lots of air underneath it. A couple steps to my left, and there's the first out. Shane Boz on the mound. He only took two pitches to get that out. And, uh, yeah, they're taking care of him in a hurry. Oh, 28 pitches into the first inning, and his bases are loaded with two out. Brendan Rodgers at the plate with a 2-2 count. Oh, boy, what do we got here? Oh, heck of a drive out into deep right field. Not quite deep enough because I can get to it, and that is how you work out of the jam in the first inning. 29 pitches. Man, that's a rough start. Anyway, bottom half of the inning. We've got a runner on second, only one away from me. Nick Lodolo on the mound. He's got a 96-mile-an-hour four-seamer. Also hits 94 for the two-seamer. Nothing else faster than 87 miles an hour. Speaking of which, there's an 81 mile an hour changeup that I was out in front of and ripped it just foul down the third base line. That gives me a count of 0-1. Well, it gives me another slider in the zone. This time I put it out into right field. That's off the wall in the visitor's bullpen. Stand up double here, and he's going to score all the way from first place on that one. First base. My goodness, I cannot talk today. RBI double. That's my 20th double of the season. Hit streak still intact. Willie Adamas coming up to the plate here in the top of the third. St. Louis up two to nothing. Nobody on. One away here for Willie. And a 2-2 pitch. He sends out into right field. And boy, he put that right down the line about perfectly. And there it is off the wall in the corner. And he gets the stand-up double with ease. And there's that weird washout that this game seems to like doing in certain uh, time of day instances. It's the bottom of the third, we're up two to nothing still. Runners on first and second with nobody out. There's a slider just above the knees. Couldn't quite steer that one into play. So I've got an 0-1 count here with nobody out. Easy take on the four seamer away. Worked it back to even, one and one here. I have to wonder what we're gonna see here. There's one. Shoots through the hole on the left side. Runner's going to score from second. And now we're up 3 to nothing with runners on first and second still. I will take it. RBI single worked just as well as solo home runs as far as I'm concerned. Back up to the plate. Bottom of the fourth. Score is now 6 to nothing. Runner on first. Nobody out. TJ Zoich on the mound. I don't know how you say his name. 96 mile an hour sinker. 89 on the cutter, not exactly the hardest thrower. And I find a hole on the right side. They cannot get me out in this game. We got runners on first and second, starting off the bottom of the fourth. Wow. Like I was saying just a little bit ago, we are really streaky. Willie Adamas at the plate here in the top of the fifth. Runner on first, nobody out for him. He puts a little line drive and finds some outfield grass there. Advances the runner to second. And they've got runners on first and second with nobody out to start off the fifth. Cody Bellinger comes up to the plate next. 
We've got one out now. 0-2 count for him here with runners on first and second still. Score is still 6 to nothing. Cardinals on top. Here is the 0-2 pitch. Barely have to move to get to this one. And we're going to get that to third base. Another horrible throw. Well, down the line from third base bag. Probably could have ran and made it. Junior Bravo now on the top of the sixth. Nobody on. Two away. He's 0 for 1. His batting average was horrible. Did I see sub 200 on that? My gosh. Puts a good little drive into this one to right field, but I'm going to be able to get underneath it to make the out to end the top of the sixth. The bottom half of the sixth coming up to the plate. Nobody out, nobody on here. I hit a sinker my first or last at bat against uh, this pitcher. Swing and a miss on the slider just below the knees. Decent timing, just not a good pitch to swing at, and it's an 0-1 count. Next pitch has me fishing at the slider low and away. I've dug my own hole, 0-2. It should, could be 2-0, but no, not today, good sirs. And I ripped that circle change foul, only 80 miles an hour on the pitch. I was way out in front of that. 0-2 pitch one more time. A slider on the outer third of the plate, and I pulled that to left field and foul. Let's say 0-2 again. Got me fishing on the slider away. Not a shocker. I don't think any of those pitches I saw were in the zone. Well, no, there was two. Still, bottom of the eighth, 7 nothing. One out, nobody on. Got me up at the plate, fouling off it. Uh, change up just above the knees. Three for four on the day. This pitcher here has got a 92 mile an hour. Four seamer, 90 on the two seamer. Nothing else over 84 miles an hour in his repertoire. Change up at 79 miles an hour, well outside of the zone. Is now a 1 1 count in the bottom of the eighth here. Let's go, boys. And put that one into foul territory behind third, and that's going to be caught for an out. <laughs> what the heck? Why is that animation in there? <laughs> I didn't even leave the batter's box when that was caught. We do end up winning the game, though. Score is 7 to nothing. We're going on to the fourth game. See if we can salvage a 2-2 split in this four-game set. And here we go. All right, top of the first. Willie Adamas at the plate. Two out, nobody on for him. He's got an 0-2 count. He's got the fourth-best batting average in the National League at 3-12. So he's uh, quite the stud at the plate. Puts one out towards the gap, but not far enough. That's an easy play to end the inning. We're heading on to the offensive side of baseball. Let's go. Runner on first and one away for me as I'm stepping into the, the box. There's a 10-game hit streak on the line. 333 batting average. Chase Petty on the mound for Cincinnati. He's got a 97-mile-an-hour four-seamer, 96 on the two-seamer, and a decent slider at 88. I'll watch that four-seamer there just on principle. Oh, apparently we are working on a game-and-a-half lead over the Brewers coming into this game. That's interesting. Checking on the runner at first. Don't worry about him. You can get me to ground into a double play just fine and dandy. Come on, big shoots. Let's go. Chopper to third. Not going to be able to get the double play, but he does get me out at first by a mile. So there's two outs with the runner on second now. Nothing comes of it top of the second. Cody Bellinger only hitting 203 here. Oof. Nobody on for him. One away. One, two count. Let's see what he's sending out to right field. they got quite a big shift going on here. And yeah, he puts one deep into right field. Gonna make the warning track? Not quite. Easy play though to make it two away in the second inning. Top of the second still. Brendan Rodgers coming up to the plate. 0-1 count for him. He's only hitting 220 this season. So here we go. Let's see what he's sending out to right field. Another good drive. Am I going to make the warning track on this one? Oh, you betcha. Back against the wall, but we make the play. And that ends the top of the second. Bottom of the fourth. Still no score. Nobody out, nobody on for me coming into the plate. Oh, power swing for a hit. What the heck? I already got uh, enough weird things to try to do in this game. Extending the hit streak, blah, blah, blah. 
And there's a four-seamer that I was way late on. I don't even know how it made contact, seeing how I did the power swing thing. All right, here we go. 0-1 pitch. And that's an easy take slider away. It's now back to even at 1-1. One and one. Mm, swing and a miss at the slider, low and away there. That makes it a one and two count in this at bat. I don't think it's going to happen to get a base hit with a power swing. Ooh, four seamer. Right at the top of the zone, but just off the plate away. Tough take there. I thought that was going to be strike three, and no, it's even at two and two. Puts a slider in the zone. A little bit out in front of that bad boy. Fouled it off. Keep it at two and two. Sixth pitch of the at bat on the way here. And I swing it to miss the four-seamer above the zone. There's a strikeout. I haven't had one of those for a little while. All right, top of the fifth. Still no score. Brendan Rodgers at the plate again. Nobody on. One away for him. 2-2 two -two pitch, and he puts it deep into right field here. We're going to try to run this one down. Oh, yeah, piece of cake. Two away. See if we can get back to the offensive side of the ball here. No, sir. Aristides Aquino took coming to the mound. The mound. Coming to the plate here. He's one for one on the day so far. He's got a two on count with nobody on here in the top of the fifth. Game is still has no score. He puts a little floater out here to right field. Running kind of deep there, but making the play just short of the warning track to end the fifth inning. All right, bottom of the sixth. Still no score. Runner on first. Nobody out here. I'm coming up to the plate. Still got the Cincinnati starter on the mound. And that's an easy take on the four-seamer way away. Of course, they flash up the thing. Oh, you've grounded into 12 double plays. Guess who doesn't care? Me. And that's another easy take, four-seamer way above the zone. It's a 2-0 count in a hurry here. His energy is disappearing. He's still got a lot of confidence, though. He puts one right down Broadway with that slider, and it finds the center fielder's glove, though. Had quite a rip on it. Just could not do anything positive with it. Bottom of the ninth. Still rocking the over on this game. No score, though. Nobody on. Nobody out. Leading things off against Luis Castillo. He's got a 90-mile-an-hour circle change. 99 on the four-seamer. 97 on the sinker. 89 on his slider. So he's a bit of a hurler here. And popping that one into foul territory down the first base line. But it finds the ground before it finds a glove. So it's just a strike instead of an out. It's now 0-1. And circle change there a little out in front of. Swinging and fouling that one off. It's an 0-2 count in a hurry. And this uh, this hit streak of mine is in danger. And I swing it a miss. The four-seamer up above the zone. That's the end of the hit streak. Also, another strikeout in this one. Not a good time. We somehow managed to walk it off, though. What inning did we do that in? I don't even know. We did do it in the ninth. Awesome. All right. We held Cincinnati to one hit throughout the whole game. That's rather impressive. And we end up splitting the four-game series here. So, yeah, that's all right. It's tolerable. Not the best-case scenario, but it is what it is. End of the series. End of the episode. So, yeah, if you're still here hanging out with me, thanks for being here. I really appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Do all the fun social media things. We'll see you in the next one.